to this week's edition of The Tribe. I'm Kendra. And I'm Hannah. Congratulations to the following students on Performances Wednesday at the first speech meet. Hope Safko, third place, informative. Karina Pebley, second place, declamation. And Jackie Honkis, second place, prose. Ski Club members, please remember to turn in all money and forms to Mrs. Stenkin by December 16th. And in in, here's this week's quote. Start by doing what's necessary, then do what's possible, and suddenly you are doing the impossible. And now, a promo video on why you should rent a senior elf. My name is Aaron Brzezonski. I'm at the top of my class and the top of my game. Rent me as your elf and spend the day with me. Whoa, I didn't see you there. If you like dogs, you'll like me. Rent me said Teeter's your elf for the day. Hi, I'm Gavin Bischoff from Today in History. Wouldn't you want a tribe star following you around? <laughs> Make sure you bid for me. Please rent me. I have nothing to do at school anymore. I need some sort of excitement. Just rent me. I'm tired, bored, nothing else to do. So if you rent me as an elf, I'll bake cookies and bring them to school for you. This will be me, and that can be you. And I'll also bring you a dollar. A day with me would never be dull, so I'll get to the point. I'm the best day of all. Bid for me in the senior auction. Take a shot and bid for me. Bid for me. Get a war horse. Tyler Stump, buy me. What time is it? Time to bid. Bid for me, Kaylee. All right, buy me for the senior auction, and I will narrate everything you do for an entire day. Look, here he comes, and he's tying his shoe. Loop de loop, and pull, and pull one of yours. Pull, good. Hi, I'm Matthew Dealish, and if you want to buy me, and if you do buy me, I will let you shave my beard any way you want. Hey, I'm Mickey, I'm so fine, and I can blow your mind, so bid for me. <laughs> I'm Emily Phillippe, and my elf skills will blow you away, so bid on me. Hi, I'm Madison Walker, and I'm really just doing this because I'm very lonely. Hi, I'm Nick Sexy, and you should buy me because my shoes are brighter than my future, and I can carry you around school. Do you have no friends? Me too, so you should bid on me, Hope Zafko, because I'm lonely. Hi, I'm Brandon Gindelsperger, and you're watching Disney Channel. Buy me. Hi, I'm Logan Cronin, and call me out one more time. You're, you're out. out! Yes. Hi, I'm Lauren Sprock, and why should you be for me? So, I love puns, I'm really good at the printer, I'm pretty good at math, and I kind of need a friend. So if you need a pal, I'll be your gal. Hi, I'm Sarah Petrie, and I'm used to carrying many books, so I'll carry yours too. You should bet on me. I'm Lexi, and I'm Abby. You should bet on us because we can help you with what you need help with all today, and we're fun to be around. Hi, I'm James Lampkin. I got homecoming king, and I can be your king for a day. Give me a shot and rent me as your senior elf. A day with me would be ballin'. Hi, I'm Kay Witten. If you rent me as your elf, I'll be sure to bring the Christmas spirit all day long while you get to spend the day with me. So please rent me. Hi, I'm Sammy Davis, and you should bid on me because I'm actually the size of an elf. Hi, my name's Amy Roberts. Don't leave me on the shelf this season and save me, please. My name is Paige King, and if you bid on me, I'll do all your pages of homework. I'm Serena DiLoretto, and if you bid for me, I'll be a real cat. Throw out your money and reel me in. <laughs> All these people running to bid for me. Hurry, hurry, and bid for curry. Hi, I'm Matthew Dillon. And I'm Gavin Bischoff. Today is December 8th, 2017. On this day in 1980, John Lennon was shot in Manhattan and this was today in history. See you next week. The Spanish Club is now selling peppermint and warhead candy grams for $1. They can be purchased in Senora O'Donnell's room, lunches, and in the main entrance in the morning. Singagrams can also be purchased for an additional dollar. Feliz Navidad, everyone!
Chief Meteorologist Mr. Perry here with your weekend weather. And this Friday we're going to have highs of 34 with lows of 20. Saturday we're going to have highs of 40 with lows of 21. And Sunday we're going to have highs of 27 with lows of 21 again. Enjoy your weekend. It's going to be cold. Welcome to another episode with Nick the Weatherman here. Today's weather is sunny but partly cloudy and a little bit cold all weekend. Back to the studios. Sponsored by Conoma Township Rotary Interact Club and Common Ground Outreach. Hi, I'm Kelly Burkheimer, the high school guidance counselor, just talking about December, uh, which starts December 11th and goes through December 22nd, where we invite students to wear a dress every day to school. On those days, um, we ask you to recruit family and friends to sponsor you. Uh, we have a suggestion of a $10 donation, and if you set a goal of getting 10 people to donate $10, right there you're donating $100. And all proceeds go to Mom's House, which is a, a great organization that provides totally safe, free childcare to low-income single parents that are wishing to continue their education. So um, if you're interested, don't get caught up in the details. You know whether it should be a dress or can I wear leggings it's just about helping a great cause um, even if you donate ten dollars uh, if you don't want to participate in wearing a dress but just want to donate money um, it's all to help a lot of people that really need it so which is what this season is all about so participate in December hi I'm Haley Curry and I'm Kieran Cullen and welcome back to the tribe sports Today the boys basketball team will be participating in the Ron Davidson Tournament. Next week the girls basketball team has a game away on Monday at Shanksville. And now out to our live sports reporter, Gage Lewis. We're here with varsity basketball player Cassidy Wilson. Cassidy, what's going to be the key to your team's success? Um, because we have such short numbers, I think if we work together and give 100% every practice and game, we should be successful. What's your first game? Our first game is next Monday again Shanksville at Shanksville. Good luck. Thank you. Welcome back to Middle School News with Hannah and Lincoln. Get ready for Christmas Spirit Week. The week of December 18th, please wear the following. Monday, Ben and Green Day. Tuesday, Pajama Day. Wednesday, Ugly Sweater Day. Thursday, Play in the Snow. And Friday, Santa Hat Day. Donate to the American Cancer Society. The TSA Community Service Video Group is collecting in the office. Donate a few dollars or even your pocket change. Every penny. To the question of the week. I'm Abby and I'm Maya. And today we're here with Cody. And the question is, what is your favorite candy cane flavor? Peppermint. Now we're here with Mrs. Lyons. And the question is, what is your favorite candy cane flavor? Sweet tart flavored candy cane. Now we're here with Sierra and Brooke. And the question is, what is your favorite candy cane flavor? Mint, because it's minty. Now we're here with Mr. Kramer. And the question is, what is your favorite candy cane flavor? I prefer the green spearmint flavor. And our favorite candy cane flavor is sweet tart. Thanks for watching. See you next week. Hi, welcome back to Middle School Sports with Owen and Ben. The girls' junior high basketball team opened up their season with a win against Ferndale on Wednesday. The boys opened up their season against Ferndale yesterday. Welcome back to the Middle School Mythbusters with Ethan. Today we have an alleged myth of the 
upstairs about how there's children laughing. It, it comes from an anonymous teacher. Let's go. Okay, so the story com comes from a teacher that states that he heard giggles coming near the art room. We think that the giggles might be coming from the book storage. Okay, so this teacher thought the giggling was coming from the art room, but we think it was coming from the book storage. And he thought that it would, might have been kids pranking him and they were hiding in the art room. But that isn't that likely that they'd be there. It was really late at night. So, but he did think that they were pranking him, so he opened the door and then he closed it. Because he thought that the students would come out and, like, scare him, but they never did. Hi, it's Hunter and Ruby, and these are the birthdays of the week. Happy birthday to Devin Foster, Hunter Thomas, Charles Bates, Aaron Berzonski, Haley Curry, Mackenzie Delosh, Tyler Poznanski, and Grace Thomas. Happy birthday! See you next week! Happy birthday.